What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my studio. So, if you are a fan of both Deadpool and Wolverine, this video is definitely for you because what I'm about to show you is really exciting because a lot of us already knew that this film was going to blow up, but I didn't think that it was going to make this much money during this opening weekend. So, Deadpool and Wolverine open with 400 and 38.3 million worldwide beating the likes of Avengers Endgame and the Marvels now ever since this news came out everybody on Twitter especially the Marvel fans were really upset about this news because they think that their movie is way better than Deadpool and Wolverine and to be honest with you I did not really like the Marvels because even though I appreciate the Beast cameo from the X-Men setting up the theoretical debut of the X-Men in the MCU. So at least they pretty much setting up the X-Men being in the MCU. Much like how Deadpool and Wolverine did with a bunch of cameos, very good fan service, and the story even though it was mixed, but I appreciate for what it was trying to do. Not only that, but James Gunn, I mean James Gunn, took the time on Twitter to even congratulate both Ryan Reynolds and Hugh Jackman. Wow, over 206 million for Deadpool and Wolverine this weekend. So happy for Ryan Reynolds and Hugh Jackman, Sean Levy, Kevin Foggy, all my friends over at Marvel Studios and moviegoers. Congrats. And that's where it should be about. Nothing but love and support and respect for one another like if you like dc go for it if you love marvel go for it but we shouldn't be fighting of which franchise is better both franchise has its flaws it has its unique charm and it has its own identity so it shouldn't be about why is this character better than this character and like i said both characters are pretty much great they're all heroes you have your villains you have your heroes and they're all a part of this comic book world but i think what deadpool and wolverine did was they pretty much fixed their timeline setting up the return of the x-men characters from the foxes universe and add them into the mcu storyline with a plot so to me i just knew when the trailers first came out way back in February during the Super Bowl, that in the second trailer and the final trailer, we all knew that this film was gonna blow up for sure. And just like we predicted it, just like I predicted it, because with all of the cameos and the returning characters from the Foxes universe, they were all done perfectly in Deadpool and Wolverine. They gave, you know, so they gave them so much to do. Not just cameos, they gave Electra Wesley Snipes' Blade and Channing Tatum's Gambit and X-23. They gave them a lot to do while fighting Cassandra Nova and, you know, just fighting people in general. And at the end of the day, I'm just glad that Deadpool and Wolverine were able to make that much money in the box office, just like I knew they would. And they pretty much saved the MCU, in my honest opinion. So what are your thoughts on this news? Are you excited about this? Let me know in the comments down below.